Hey guys, I'm back again with more Kindergarten 2, and today we're gonna get rid of that troublesome Penny. So far, I've not heard a single good thing about her from any of the other kids, so let's, uh, let's befriend Penny and stab her in the back. Oh, thanks Penny. Thanks for the friendship bracelet. I totally need that. Hey Carla, how do I get rid of Penny? Okay, so Penny's the snitch. It's nigh on impossible to get contraband into the school. What kind of contraband would kindergarten and like kids be trying to get into a school? Other than, you know, these mental crazy ones who probably have guns and stuff. And You know, you've got Monty who sells crack. Cool, thanks for that. We'll start the downward spiral now. The first thing I need to do to start this is to get some contraband confiscated by Penny and then go to talk to Bugs. We're going to become best friends with Bugs today. What do you mean contraband? Well, that's kind of rude. My first day here, I didn't know the rules and you're immediately going to put me in study hall just because I have a firecracker. Who even gives you the right to confiscate it? Oh, your mum's the principal, so that's all fine for you then? Yeah, that's great. Lucky for some, right? Right. Now, head on over and we'll talk to him because I've just had my firecracker lost. And Bugs is always uh, annoyed about the fact she took his knife. Wait, she called you fat and ugly bugs? Good self-esteem right there. Real good self-esteem bugs. Right, yep, we can take her out. Damn right I'm smart enough to get into the smart class. Yep, cool, no problem. Yeah, I think we can still be friends, Penny. Maybe. Thanks for the double friend bracelet. I wonder if I can sell these to Monty. Yep, I'm gonna go to the smart class today. Right, that's where Penny is in the smart class. Let's get this sorted. Yes, yes, Mr. Forehead. Einstein built ray guns in kindergarten, and I need to do my assessment on the computer. Yeah, you gotta reward me for doing it. Right, hey Penny. You know, you said you always sit alone. I can quite clearly see that Carla is sat right next to you. Okay, so you just want me to get a doll for you. Great. Yep, that's all they reward you with here. It's just cleaning supplies. May I leave? Thanks. Right, so we're gonna need to go steal a doll to make Penny like us. Cool. And of course the doll is down here. And of course, she's already taken the doll. Yeah, sure, I'll play house with you. This never ended well back in Kindergarten 1. But, looks like I've got a shortcut. Add Cindy. Add. This is how I say it's gonna work. I'm gonna train you into being a good girl. Now give me the doll. Thank you, Cindy. Hi, Miss Applegate. Yeah, I'm meant to be in the smart class. I'll go back to the smart class. I know you can't deal with more kids than you thought you were gonna have. Because you were like one step away from a complete and utter mental breakdown. 
Hey, I uh, I got your um, I got your doll. Yep, here you go. Cool. That would that would be great if you didn't tell anyone that I had all that contraband. That would make me happy. Thanks for giving me the thing hidden inside the doll that your mom took off of you. Okay, you hide that doll after I went and got it for you. I guess I, uh... Hey, what are you looking for, Monty? I to upgrade the precision of the laser cannon on your chair. Interesting. Pretty sure if you talk to Mr. Forehead, he'll be able to help you with that. Wow, drum. Way to bring down the party. Right, um... I guess I just eat an apple? Cool. Uh, yeah, I guess I eat an apple and then we go talk to bugs at dinner time? Yeah, I know. Yep, looks like I just eat an apple. told me to smooth talk to the uh, principal, did you? Oh man. Speed run. Gotta go all the way back here, do all of this again. Just so I can talk to the principal and have lunch with her. Do all this again. Hey bugs, um, I'm here and I have this computer chip. I'm gonna get do it in the principal's office, right? That's a good thing that I um, arranged to uh, go have lunch with her. That's, that's a real smart idea I had there. Yes, I'm going to the uh, principal's office. Yeah, your sister doesn't like you. She likes me more. Because I'm a child and she can do strange experiments on me. Like all the principals seem to do in this goddamn world. What has happened to her head? What did Bugs do? Oh, Tonda. Oh, it's a food fight. <laughs> goddamn, it looked like she had just like strange growths growing out of her head. Yeah, we'll pick this up later. Yeah, go. Go on, go on, Principal, leave me alone in your office. Right, let's have a look. So, this is the computer, but before that, I can see a strange red book. Mm, just a Monster Mon card. I'm a little disappointed they didn't open a secret layer. What else is there? Still the computer. The pink plant that, yeah. Mr. Forehead probably made. Uh, I just stole some of the principal's clubs. Yeah, that's fine. I also just unlocked just patriotism. So let's pop the disc in there. Uh, I can grab the document. What did you do with the old kids? Tomorrow will never come. I have this weird condition where I groundhog day until I manage to bring down the principal, so... <laughs> You'll never see tomorrow. Oh yeah, here bugs, they uh, brought the report. Yep, Monty, can you read this?
Aha, uh -huh, I can go to recess. Don't worry, Bugs, leave it to me. I'll find out what's on this uh, sheet of paper and we'll see how we can destroy Penny with it. So, first things first. Yo, Monty. You've had all of five seconds. Have you read it? Yep, cool. What's it say? Penny is an android. I was aiming for alien, but I guess android makes sense. She's attacked by a bear or something. So her mum replaced a lot of her parts and then gave remarks to the teachers and kept one herself. That's messed up. And if someone says I'm sending you to the principal's office, then it activates her. Oh, and of course, all of the stuff we need is inside of Penny. All the contraband is inside of her. So we need to use a giant magnet to magnetize her to get inside of her. And that would change the lesson plan. Yeah, bugs. I can do that. I'll go through the principal's office. We're going to bust this girl's head wide open. Probably literally if we're going to kill her with a magnet. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right, going to sneak straight through the principal's office. Nothing to see here. Oh, please don't notice me. That's it, folks. Distract her. Good thing that she uh, couldn't see past the actual screen where I was in plain view in the hallway. Thank God for game limitations. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna get in the science room and then I'm just gonna... Yeah, I can do all this. Change the lesson plan, go outside. Can we just speak for a second as well about the fact that, like, you have to pay? Like, to go to science class. Like, what the hell kind of school is this? I, I can understand, yeah, having the smart kids and the uh, dumb kids in separate classes. They do that in all schools. But having to literally pay to not do gym. Like, that's, that's, that's capitalism at its finest. Uh, just ignore me, Mr. Murder Janitor. I'm gonna sneak on back outside. I wonder what would happen if I had just waited in the, in the principal's office. Probably death. Uh, yeah, I'll pay your damn fee to go to the principal's office. Principal's office? Go to the lab. Yep, it's, uh, oddly, yeah, it's magnets today, Mr. Forehead. Moving bullets from furniture or planes from the sky. Ah, someone sabotaged your magnet. One of the gears is missing. Hmm. Yep, let's go find, let's go find the gear so we can finish science class. And also murder Penny. Yeah, what's up, Penny? Oh, you have blackouts and you think that you stole the gear? Something's different since you met me. Yes, there are people who actually know you're a robot and know how to kill you. Please don't trust me, Penny. Don't trust me, I'm a terrible, terrible human being. Um, yeah, Mr. Forehead, I'm, I'm going outside to look for the gear, so... Yeah, sure. I won't go downstairs. Uh, I need to go downstairs. Ephraim Pass, he's got a whole pass and I got a lighter. What do you want, Carla? Oh, oh great. She has a special laser module. That must be what she used to kill me in the past. Yeah. Oh, of course, you all ignore the fact that she has these blackouts and kills kids. Silly me, why didn't I think of that? 
So I need to go get the doll that will keep her calm and not murder everyone. I've got your doll. Yeah, I've got wait, we're trying to get the gear from your locker. No, you don't you don't need to protect yourself. Here, Penny, have a dolly. Things were better and things were simpler then. Yeah, they were. Right, you guys uh you got my gear? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, yeah, we'll bring you the laser module. But first, I have another murder to attend. Uh, I guess I'd give it to you? Yeah, have, have the gear. This is what you're missing, right? You don't feel so good, Ape. Oh, God! Yeah, Mr. Forehead, you're so fired. We just, uh, we ripped off Penny's head. Yeah, Ozzy, no one does like you, but still, good zinger. Don't do any drugs unless I gave them to you. That's a brilliant, like, final message. He just, he was out of there. He just, he just went straight through the ceiling. Like, nope, not dealing with the fact that I just killed the principal's daughter. Yeah, let's get out of here, bugs. Just committed a murder and got forehead to fly away. And poor Nugget, as always, is walking out with no arm. I wonder what Bugget, Bugget's, I wonder what Nugget's family think when he gets home. Yeah, we took out an android and got your knife back. It was a good day. Here's uh, yeah, thanks for the laser module. Where's my firecracker? I know I don't get to keep it, but. Where's, where's my firecracker? Did you steal my firecracker, Bugs? You stole my firecracker and then gave me the job of talking to Cal tomorrow with the laser beam. God, you're an ass. Well, that was another episode of Kindergarten 2. Slowly working our way through everyone who's left there. And if you did enjoy this, don't forget to like and subscribe.